Yes. I've been casing those ghouls for weeks, waiting for an opening. And you dive in, and choppy chop, bang bang, and the whole lot of them dead. You even know what you got right there? A premium set of Pelman's power tools. I remember commercials for Pelman's tools. Expensive stuff, the top of the line. What the hell's a commercial? Wait, it don't matter. Oh, Mariner sent you. Didn't she? Goddamn Mitch and his big mouth. No matter what she's offering, it's nothing. Serious builders were given arm for them tools. I'll pay you 2,000 caps right here, right now. Deal? I'll pass on the offer. I ain't hanging around forever. Walk away from this, and you'll regret it.
tools yet? Here are your tools. A fair bit of luck running into you. Here's your reward. Well earned. And now to work on the hull. Damn the island for sending them after Petey. I wiped out the feral ghouls at the campground. The hero of our saga returns triumphant. <laughs> I bet the island didn't see that coming. It's only right you get paid for the troubles. Here's 200 caps for you. So, who else needs to be avenged? Well... I'm glad you asked. I've been thinking about what's next, and then it came to me. We all love our grandparents, don't we? Kind, gentle, doting, love to spoil you. You'd never want something awful to happen to them. Nobody would. That's why it broke my heart when I lost Grandpa George. I'm sorry. You must have been very fond of him. Everybody was. But that didn't matter to the island. Oh, no. He was cursed the moment he was born adult. He had a farm a little ways north of here. Lived a peaceful life. Working the land and not causing anyone trouble. The island sent something after him. A huge monster. Mean as spit and with claws to snap steel beams. A fog crawler. Grandpa bravely stood his ground. A shotgun in his hands, holding off that terror while the farmhands fled back here. If you can take out that shell-backed devil, it'll send a message loud and clear that says the Daltons never forget when they've been wronged. The fog crawler at the farm? It's already dead. Wonderful. That's another chapter successfully concluded. You truly are the heroic Avenger I hoped you were. With that fog crawler gone, we can send some folks up there to get the place ready for you. That's right. The farm is yours. Your own little piece of the island. It'll take work to get it up and running again, but you'll have help. And here's another 200 caps in gratitude for your service to the great Dalton lineage. Who else needs to be avenged? I was just about to explain. Now, I don't have to tell you that the bonds of blood and family are strong. As strong as any a person can know. But if you ask me, the strongest among them is the bond that exists between two married people. That's why the last part of this tale is the hardest one for me to tell. Believe me, I know exactly how you feel. If that's true, then I'm sorry to hear it. Perhaps we'll confront our pain together. My late husband, Daniel, was the best fisherman this island ever saw. He and his crew had a favorite fishing spot out by Brooks Head Lighthouse. One day, a day I'll never forget, I see Danny's boat pulling up with his crewmen all shouting and carrying on. Turns out some trappers moved into the lighthouse. No doubt because the island told them to. They're all crazier than a bag of mulberries. Their leader was having a little target practice. Shot Danny right between the eyes. Killed him, just like that. You go and get that son of a bitch. You make him pay for doing the island's bidding. I'll make that trapper pay. All right, then. Remember, trappers may be half crazy from the fog, but they still know how to use a gun. I could use time. 